My name is Abdi Kafar Mohamed Isaac and uh, I'm a software engineer and I'm also a cyber security analyst. I'm a graduate at uh, PLP Academy. I grew up in Garissa. I was born in Garissa. I schooled there until high school. Then I came to Nairobi for university. I went to National Defense University. It's in Nakuru. Uh, I did a bachelor's degree in military science, defense and security studies. I've served in the military for a period of about three years until last year I resigned and now I decided to get the tech skills, you know. I got an injury while I was in the military and uh, that uh, made me not to perform or, you know, the duties of being a military officer effectively. And so I decided to resign and uh, I had passion for tech and uh, uh, I decided now to get the skills. I have discovered PLP through a friend, uh, a friend who happens to be an alumnus at uh, PLP. Uh, he graduated at PLP. He's the one who recommended me now to join the, the program. I've liked a lot of things about the program. First of all, uh, just uh, learning new skills. I didn't do a program, I didn't do a degree in tech. I was just uh, fresh and uh, interacting with the instructors and the whole, uh, you know, management, you know, getting new skills and, you know, yeah, it's been a very interesting journey. There's a lot of activities I've participated in. There's a lot of hackathons, in-person hackathons and also other tech events. And uh, one of the most interesting things about the program is the hackathons. Uh, getting to showcase your skills, what you have learned within the program, uh, by building, you know, uh, solutions and such that will help people. And uh, I've managed to be actually the top participant in all the hackathons that I've participated in PLP. For the first hackathon, we built a portfolio website. My portfolio website was the best. For the second hackathon, we've built an event management system whereby, you know, uh, it manages events, you know, and such. I was position number two for that. For the third hackathon, I built an e-commerce website integrated with m and such, and I was the best uh, for that hackathon. And uh, we've received a lot of uh, prizes for all the hackathons, including cash prizes, uh, credit cards, and you know, swag, certificates, and so many things. The program has been structured very well. It is beginner friendly, how the instructors handle the learners. You know, if you have any clarification or if there's a field that you haven't understood, they're always there, you know, to help you, take you through the journey, make sure that you have learned the skills. Right now, I work as a software developer at a company, it's called Enovice Group, managed by Africa Cyber Defense Forum. Uh, it's a, it's a cybersecurity company that uh, it's Africa based but the headquarters is based in Nairobi right now. So I build uh, uh, security platforms for them, yes. I feel so good and I'm so proud of myself because last year, last year time like this I didn't have any idea about tech. I didn't know even how to write one single line of code. And uh, when I was joining uh, PLP at that time, I was uh, very confused. I'm like, you know, I, I don't know how things are going. And uh, I just put in hard work, you know, dedication, you know, self. I've been self-teaching myself a lot, apart from getting knowledge from the instructors. And uh, that helped me a lot. I've really gained the knowledge and skills. Up to now, I got the job as a software developer within a short period of time. That's very, very commendable. I just want to convey my heartfelt gratitude to Powerland Project and Safaricom. They have really, really impacted my life a lot and a lot, and, and I'm so grateful about them. Uh, without them, I don't think uh, I could be where I am now, because it's through the program that I have gained the skills that I'm now currently using to earn a living. And uh, you know, it's through the PLP program that made all these, these things. So I'm so grateful to Safaricom and PLP for giving me this opportunity and uh, always thank you.